you know, lifestyle frames, as in frames that like you use anytime, all the time. That's what we're talking about. Our top picks. Stick around. Hello and welcome. I'm my glass Tyler. Today we're going to be talking about the best lifestyle sunglasses of 2022. Yeah, it's a little early in the year, but I'm excited about it. So we're going to talk about it. I like lifestyle because I think that it kind of caters to the widest range of people and we can have more fun with it. The, this is a really good solid lineup. I'll admit nothing super new, but just things that I think are absolutely going to last throughout the entire year and still be amazing. Really, really solid frames, good lens tech, all available in prescription, by the way. That's important to me for sure, being Eyeglass Tyler and also us here at Sport RX. You know, that's RX, that's what that stands for. So that's what we're talking about. If at the end of this you're ready to order, don't forget about our C Better Guarantee. With that, you're never stuck with something you don't like or just doesn't work for you. You actually have as long as 45 days with them to figure that out. Yes, even if you get them in prescription, we really just want you to be happy with them. So that's all that matters to us. So we'll take care of you no matter what that means in our end. And also we have opticians who would love to help you get it right the first time. That's what we're here for. So you can always reach out to us if you need any help at all. All right, let's get into these frames. First up, we have the Oakley Holbrook. Of course, not new at all. Been in their lineup since basically forever, but still such an amazing frame. Really solid, straightforward, everyday lifestyle frame. For sure, one of Oakley's best-selling frames, especially in the lifestyle category, and for good reason, because it looks great. Unassuming, but also cool. It's really a solid style, a solid pick if you're not totally sure, especially if you love Oakley. It's a classic American style, Oakley performance tech. You have that O matter frame material, which is very durable, extremely lightweight, and very impact resistant. You also, with Oakley, of course, get their prism lens technology, which is going to help with color enhancement, making it easier to spot and track things that you're looking at for you know whatever activity you're enjoying, but also just makes the world a prettier place to look at. Keyhole bridge is a pretty cool design detail in here that you might miss if you're not an optician or know eyewear that well. The idea behind a keyhole bridge is that it helps to give you a little more versatility in bridge fit. Not all frame bridges tend to fit all nose bridges very well, and so the keyhole bridge just gives you a little more versatility there, so nothing that you have to worry about. They have a slight bend in the temple, no grip to speak of on this frame, and it holds its adjustment really, really well. Thanks to Oakley's three-point fit system, you don't have to worry about these not fitting well. One thing I will say is because of the frame material, though it holds its shape very well at kind of a double-edged sword, it is not very adjustable. So they don't fit you well off the rack. They might get a little more comfortable over time, but probably something that is not gonna work out well for you because they hold their adjustment, so, which is good, I guess, and a bad thing. When it comes to sizing, this has an SFW of 132 millimeters, which lands you in that medium range. Next up, we have a Persol. This is the PO3019S. Persol's an amazing brand. They make amazing frames. They are not so amazing when it comes to naming conventions. It's very hard to remember what the frame is, unfortunately, but still a great frame. Uh, this is a timeless style, absolutely, which was the reason that it made this list. And I feel comfortable talking about it early 2022, saying the whole year, it is gonna be amazing. Persol is known for their more elegant designs, definitely high quality craftsmanship. They go with lightweight acetate construction. They have their patented, I don't even know what they call this. I'm sure they have a name for it, but the little flexible, it's like a spring hinge without there being a spring hinge. Uh, design here in the temple gives you that much more comfort. With that being that it's acetate, it is definitely much more adjustable. Again, no grip to speak of here, but I mean, we're talking lifestyle frames. I actually think that there aren't any styles here that have grip. No, there's one. I'll talk about it when I get to it. But very adjustable, definitely nothing to worry about there. Keyhole bridge, again, like I mentioned there, really classic square shape, signature arrow on the temples that allow you to spot a persole from a mile away, which is really cool, stylish, looks good for any occasion. Of course, we're talking persole, so you get that patented Melflecto system. I didn't actually know what that was until recently. Melflecto is the name for this design here in the temple, which you get on really, I think, every per soul out there, which helps to relieve temple pressure, uh, pressure points, and it helps to mold the frame to your face, size, shape for a perfect 
fit. This frame is available in two eye sizes, a 52 eye size and a 55 eye size, which translates to 128 millimeters in the SFW and 133 millimeters respectively. And next up, we have the Spy Cyrus. We love Spy. They're actually a local to us here, Southern California brand, and they really capture that SoCal design aesthetic, I think, for sure. Very bold, lots of thickness, lots of frame, uh, lots of lens as well. Really solid design, just more of a rectangular shape here, a little more straight across the brow. I don't think you have to worry about this causing that unibrow effect thanks to a little bit of a dip here in the bridge. Classic shape, very, very spy, super thick temple. I would say that when it comes to weight, because you're thinking I'm looking at all of that material that is gonna be super heavy, they're actually surprisingly lightweight for what you're getting, and it's because of their propionate frame material. Spy is actually one of the very few brands out there to use propionate as a frame material. It is very lightweight, it is very durable. This is another one of those things where uh, it holds its shape very well, but that also means not terribly adjustable. Again, if they don't fit you well off the wall, probably not the best one to go with. And this is a larger fit as well. So something to keep in mind. When it comes to lens tech, you get Spy's Happy Lens Technology, which is Amazing, another color enhancing tint tech, which helps to block harmful UV rays, obviously, but also that bad blue light. If you're not sure what I mean by that, we've definitely done videos on that and you can check those out for more information. It's potentially harmful long-term that's different from UV, uh, but very much a part of the light spectrum. So very much out there and potentially something to be concerned with. Uh, but it does actually let in good blue light, which will help to give you a, better mood. That's why they call it the happy lens because it kind of boosts your mood because you're getting all the good blue light to your eyes. And when it comes to sizing, this has an SFW of 139 millimeters, which lands you pretty solidly in that large range. Next up, we have the Randolph Engineering Aviator. This is a classic, I would say my go-to when it comes to aviators. It's probably not the most common shape that you're gonna see in an aviator. The most common shape is probably gonna be that Ray-Ban aviator that's more that teardrop style. But I really like this. It's probably more accurately called a navigator style, but it really is the, the classic Randolph aviator. And it is made in the USA, which is cool for a lot of people out there if you're looking to support USA made frames. This is a good go-to, really solid. One of the things that you notice first and foremost, or at least I do when you pick it up, it feels substantial. It feels like you have a very durable, very well-made frame. And that's for good reason, because you do have a well-made frame in your hands. One reason that this feels a little heavier in my hands is because they went with a glass lens in this, which definitely adds a lot to weight. It is available in prescription. Like I said, all of these are, however, not in glass for prescription lenses. We have to make the lenses here uh, at Sporter X in our lab and the typical prescription lens materials are available but still an amazing setup. One of the things that sets apart this aviator and Randolph's aviator from the majority of them on the market is this bayonet temple, which is a really classic look, also a different feel and, and design on your head because instead of it wrapping behind the ear, it actually hugs the side of your head. So what they're doing is they have a really good balance of pressure so that it is holding onto your head but not causing too much pressure to give you discomfort or headaches. Very elegant style, double bridge as you would expect to see on an aviator, but it doesn't dip down quite as much. Definitely a good go-to if you're looking for an aviator style that is different from the vast majority of the aviators out there. This is available actually in three different eye sizes, a 52, a 55, and a 58. And the SFWs respectively are 132 millimeters, 136, and 143. So kind of the whole spectrum is covered. No matter what your size is, you're gonna be able to fit the aviator. Hey, if you're enjoying this content, but maybe you have additional questions about men's sunglasses, or perhaps you have prescription needs, well, reach out to one of our very friendly Sporter X opticians because they're eagerly awaiting your call and would love to help you. For even more lists of the best men's sunglasses, we have videos, we have blogs, and we'll put links in the description below. Next up is the Maui Gym Red Sands. This is a frame that makes it onto a lot of our best of lists because it is really an amazing frame. We love Maui Gym in general. You can count on quality. You can count on 
it lasting you for as long as you want them to last for you, as long as you, I mean, just normal maintenance, really solid style. The very first thing you were gonna notice when you pick up the Red Sands is how amazingly lightweight it is. Crazy lightweight, and that is thanks to their nylon injected frame material or their frame material process, whatever it is that they're doing. It honestly, it feels like it's hollow. I don't know how they do this, but what it means is that it makes it very flexible, very durable, extremely, extremely lightweight, like I said. Uh, again, probably a little less adjustable because it's one of those materials that holds its shape. Uh, I'd say maybe a little more than some of the prior ones on this table that I've said that about, uh, but still something to be aware of. More of a minimalist look, which is interesting because that lens is gigantic. I think that the any boldness that you get out of this frame is because that lens is so big. The things that I love about this, I mentioned uh, not they're not being grip on a lot of these frames. This is an exception. There's a little bit of grip on the inside embedded in the temple as well as on the nose pad. And one of the things I love about this frame is that the nose pads are actually adjustable. Very uncommon thing to see in a plastic frame like this and amazing for making it a perfect fit on your face or on your nose bridge rather. This is also, when we talk versatility, available in an Asian fit, which is the term that they use for a nose bridge that is more versatile fitting on a wider range of nose bridges, especially flatter nose bridges, but also available as readers. So you really have everything covered with the Red Sands, especially prescription. I mentioned already that all these are available in prescription. You can, of course, get Maui Jim's Polarized Plus 2 Lens Tech in prescription. Amazing. Really, you shouldn't overlook this frame because it's incredible. When it comes to sizing, this has an SFW of 138 millimeters, which will land you in that large range. Next up, we have a Rain. This is the Rain Remy, and I love Rain. They're actually another local company to us. They're up in Oceanside, which is actually quite close to us, and that's not the only reason I love them. I love them because they make really good quality frames. They're all handmade, and they are all pretty, honestly, cool, on trend, especially in this case, being a round shape, still a pretty on trend style. As you can tell, I'm a big fan of round. I almost always wear rounds. I probably should get out of that trend myself because it's like all of my frames, but I still love it. This also, like many round frames out there, employs a keyhole style bridge, a little more unique, a little more of a subtle keyhole, a little more of a modified keyhole as compared, compared to what I'm wearing right now, but you still get the same functionality, which is a more versatile fitting bridge. Another design detail that I like is that it's not perfectly round, at least visually, uh, where it has a little more of a flat spot on the top and a bit more of a unique bridge design here. A little more angular, gives a little more character, I think looks pretty cool. This frame is made out of acetate, which is very lightweight and a very good quality frame material, but also allows for much more brilliant colorways and more interesting, unique colorways. And when it comes to sizing, this is available in two eye sizes, a 49 and a 52, which translates to to an SFW of 128 millimeters and 132 millimeters, which lands you in that small and medium range. And last but certainly not least, we have a Zeal. Zeal Optics, this is the Campo. I love Zeal. This frame is made actually from a very similar process as the aforementioned Red Sand, so incredibly lightweight. Again, the first thing you notice when you pick it up is how wildly lightweight this frame is. Also, it is eco-friendly. They use their Z-Lite resin frame material ultra lightweight, as I mentioned, nice and flexible, holds its shape. Same thing applies where it's gonna be not quite as adjustable, probably around the same amount of adjustability as the Red Sand, so more so than the prior ones. Uh, but it's actually also eco-friendly, which is very cool. Zeal has a, a big heart for eco-friendly construction and materials, and so definitely something to make you feel a little better about this frame, especially if you like the style, which you should. It's really solid, straightforward, more squared, I'd say than rectangular, yes. Uh, however, it's not super common to find a true squared lens, and so I like it when I see it. Uh, again, a little more of a straight across design on the top, but thanks to that notch in the bridge, it doesn't give you that unibrow effect nearly as much. This is another one that has some grip on it. It has an embedded grip on the inside of the temple, the ends of the temple, and then also on the inside of the nose bridge. When you're getting them in non-prescription, again, like I mentioned, all of these available in prescription, this comes with their E-Loom Polarized Lens Tech, which is also sustainable and made from bio-based materials. 
in prescription, however, you do lose that. So something to be aware of if that's a big deal for you. There really isn't any option, unfortunately, that's an eco-friendly material like you get in the non-prescription that's available in prescription anywhere on the market that I'm aware of. So that just it just is what it is, unfortunately. Really solid style, love Zeal. All of their styles are polarized. Really, really solid quality optics for sure. When it comes to sizing, this has an SFW of 137 millimeters, which lands you in that large range. And if you notice, I did say last but not least, but it's actually not last but not least. We have one more last but not least. If you notice this guy sneaking into frame uh, bit by bit, this is our frame. This is a Sporter X Huxon. I think very much worth your time in learning about it. Obviously, I'm a little biased. I can't not be, but I think it's fair that I think that this is an amazing frame because it is. This is a, it was a frame that we designed, we manufactured, we took all of our favorite features from, honestly, a lot of these top frames and we put them into one do-it-all sunglass. Really good kind of laid back athleisure style, really good for all day, everyday use, but also not at all out of place in really any sport or aggressive scenario. We also went with an eco-friendly resin that is very lightweight and very durable. We went with cam hinges. We did put, of course, grip on there. That's important to us for really any frame out there, because why not? You have it in the nose bridge embedded as well as on the temple tips really solid style. We have a few other styles as well, but this is the one I think that makes the most sense in this list. Really great also with a range of prescriptions, by the way. Like I said in the beginning, that's super important to us here. And so we like a wide range of prescriptions that we can cater to. Really good for sweating in, really good for everyday use. Uh, there's a reason I put it in as a little bonus frame for you. When it comes to sizing, this has an SFW of 136 millimeters. So it lands in that large range. So that wraps it up for our top picks for men's lifestyle sunglasses of 2022. Hopefully now you have a strong contender for your next perfect pair. And if you are ready to order any of these amazing styles, stick around for a moment longer. We'll have an easy to click shop now button. And again, if you're ready to order, do not forget about that Sea Better Guarantee. I really think it gives you a ton of peace of mind. And if peace of mind is your thing, us opticians reaching out to us is like peak peace of mind because we're here to make sure you get the right thing the first time. It's like our whole reason for existing. So why not use us? Reach out to us. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this was interesting or valuable information. If so, throw us a like because that helps us out. You can find relevant videos over here if you're ready to shop any of these great styles because why would you not be? Click this button right here. It'll take you right to them. If you're ready to consume some more content, we all are, right? Let's be honest. You should check us out on all the social media outlets because I think you'll like it. That's why I recommend it.